as the various stakeholders continue to do their post-mortem post and provide feedback on the just concluded carnival celebrations in Trinidad and Tobago, Senior Superintendent Rodil Kirk of the Trinidad and Tobago Police Service, Tobago Branch, stated that despite a few minor incidents, Tobago experienced one of the safest national carnivals in a long time. Here is more. According to Superintendent Rudel Kirk, the Tobago leg of the National Carnival was a success from a law enforcement perspective. He said it was amongst the safest compared to those held within the last six years. Kirk noted there was some misunderstanding over the location of some carnival events. He got the information that Crown Point and Roxborough were the two main hubs, but not to take our eyes off Scarborough and we did that. We had resources on the ground. We recognize that nothing much didn't happen and, and you know, everything went well. We, we are thankful for that. Kirk stated as the cruise ship was in port and the oil spill cleanup also occurred, Scarborough was limited to where people could traverse. Hence, persons went to Roxborough and Crown Point. And what we recognize is that within the Crown Point area on Monday morning, roughly about 3,000 masqueraders taking the streets. Uh, that that um, concluded around 10 a.m. and the people dispersed quietly again with no incident. So I want to also thank the Tobago public for you know being well behaved during the carnival period. Roxbury itself, um, Juve morning had one music truck and roughly about six to seven hundred persons you know um, behind the music truck as well. They didn't have no bands per se. Again. Everyone was well behaved. A bomb threat report and around three robbery complaints caught the attention of the TTPS. However, these incidents were not related to carnival activities. What we also have is that persons were called off their, their vacation leave and they did answer that call. Not forgetting the, the members of the Defence Force, TTR and, and the Coast Guard who came out and were always there to support us. So, you know, I, I, I want to also extend my sincerest gratitude to, to these stakeholders for, you know, standing by the police in terms of having the resources on the ground to treat with any eventualities. Regarding the TTPS's efforts to decrease the number of road fatalities, the TTPS will continue to advise motorists to drive carefully. Taninka Kukshank, Tobago Updates Television News.